Hey everyone, welcome back to Amnesia Rebirth. Uh, I want to mention something before I continue. It's been over two months since I recorded the last episode. Uh, yeah, and after not recording it for so long, there's this like weird pressure that builds up inside of me that makes me more and more and more nervous to start up again. Feels like, like, oh no, I'll come back to it and I'll have forgotten how to commentate and how to play and yeah, so... I'm actually kind of nervous to record this episode because I'm like, what if it's a disaster? It should be fine. I looked at the controls. I looked around in the notes a little bit. I know I remember the basics of what's going on and where we are. But yeah, some of the like real small specifics I might have forgotten. Sorry. But it should be all right. I know that we got a decent amount of matches, decent amount of lantern fuel, although I think the 6 out of 10 indicates it'll last for 6 seconds. If I remember right, the lantern doesn't last very long. We got this little thing, and we can check our baby. I shouldn't have taken this risk. Um, yeah, and we just arrived in, I think this is medical supply, a medical supply area, or just a supply area or something. But I think we're supposed to mix together the stuff for, uh, I guess, probably part of the, th uh, well, it's gunpowder, so I guess it's going to be part of the shell that we're going to construct to put in the tank so we can blow open the door. I think something like that. Anyway, check out this little guy. Sorry, if you're terrified of spiders, sorry, I'm not. I just think they're really cute. Look at him. Flow on stock till Corporal Kadir. Did we not pick this note up last episode? No, we definitely picked this up last episode, but I'll just read it again. Flow on sulfur stock. Check medicine supply for ointment of sulfur. Boil to extract. Not ideal. Makes powder mix unpredictable, but better than nothing. Ask Corporal Kadir if in doubt. Oh no, it just stays there. That makes sense. Because this is probably where we're actually going to construct it. Uh, oh, right. So the shell is actually already there, and the head as well. So yeah, we just need the gunpowder mix, and then we can make a round to put in the tank. I ordered the saltpeter for tanning, not for your powder. I've moved it up to my stores, and there it stays. Requisition your own. Delacroix, quartermaster. <laughs> Stop making explosives. I want a tan leather. Um, bunch of people's names. Important. Before you take the goods up to the main building, check Corporal Delacroix is available. The quartermaster must be present at all times to check the delivery. Do not leave boxes out in the sun. I forgot how good all the interaction sounds are. So good. Ooh, what is this thing for? Don't use on metal. Oil blade after use. There's a blade on this thing? Where? I really can't fathom what this is for. Oh, there's the blade. Is this like a really old saw table of some sort? How does it work? Like reciprocating saw or something? Huh. Oh! 
Fucking hell. Well, that almost killed us. Right, they were setting up traps. Right. That's a good thing to remember. Let's go here first. Is that the only thing to light up in this room? Good enough, I think. Yeah, I got a whole workshop here. Bunch of things. Not sure what they all are. That's obviously a forge. Or... Yeah, yeah. back around to the beginning. Oh, I love that sound as you take off the top. That's probably where we're going to boil the medicine or whatever it was. Grind? Is that some sort of grinder? I think maybe. Uh, maybe we grind up this stuff. Chocolate. It's a milling machine. Let's go into the room of death now, I guess. Okay, look at our lantern fuel. It's already almost empty. Oh, it is empty. <laughs> and I don't think we have any fuel to fill it up. No, just a bottle of laudanum. I don't think that burns. Oh my god, there's bones hanging from razor wire. Examine the body more once I've lit up this place as much as I can. It's not as many lights as I'd like.
I think that's as good as it gets. Jesus Christ. Careful. Careful, this is rigged. Hmm? Some sort of trap. Oh god, yeah. Wow. I should look closer before trying that. It's connected to a grenade. We don't really have anything to cut it. Um you know what we could do? Like, I don't see any reason you couldn't stick your hand through the bar and light a match and use that to just burn off the string. But I doubt it's gonna let me do that. Yeah, nah. We got six matches. The following items are off limits without authority of the captain. Medicine and strong spirits. The cage is not to be opened without a senior officer present. Rug physics. Ugh. I want to see if there's anything on their belt or something. Oh, I think we're going out there. Maybe out here. Looks like someone else has been, or something else has been out here. I don't know, it looks awfully black. But then again, I think Old Blood does turn much more really, really dark red, blackish, brownish, than actually, like, bright red. Maybe this isn't such a great idea. the best idea we got. Oh, we need to close that door. <laughs> or window. Hold on, baby. I wish you were with me. Ooh. Bottles of laudanum. To those who come after us, I have failed. We tried to die in defiance, but these devils will not allow it. The screaming does not stop. I cannot shut it out. I cannot bear it. They treat my men as a cruel child treats a puppy, reveling in the joy of their pain, 
and they watch me all the while. Alderic keeps crying my name. I'm gonna butcher these names, sorry. Gardenier has stopped breathing. He's the lucky one. Suicide is a sin, but the Lord has deserted us, and I will not give these demons their satisfaction. So here I take my stand and make my death on my own terms. I pray you, do not tell my Aurelie of this fate. Tell her we died in some glorious, noble purpose, and that I was a father to be proud of. She has done nothing to deserve this hurt. Captain Augustine. Ah, so they overdosed on the laudanum. this cut it something please or do we just leave it alone maybe we just leave it alone We just do this. Yeah. Oh, oh, that stretched it a little bit more than I would like. Let's just gently lay that on their lap. Yes. Uh, do we need the grenade? Do we need the grenade for something? Medical supplies. I found a amount of sulfur. Perfect. Laudanum elixir, the universal household medicine. Tincture of opium. That's an interesting device. What is that? So complex. I guess I should see if I can get the grenade. I don't know. No, 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 no. Shit. Shit, come on. Perhaps I shouldn't have done that. Maybe that was the only way out. I don't know if this was locked. I didn't try it. So do we have everything we need now? What did we need again? Quartermaster's stores has the saltpeter, right? So that's the one thing we need, the saltpeter. Got charcoal and sulfur. Where is the quartermaster's stores? Like, how do I get there? Because this is the end of this place.
And I haven't gained any new keys. Just the location of the supplies. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure where I haven't explored. I remember there being a sign on a door over here. Perhaps this was the quartermaster's stores? Well, it says quartermaster only, so I assume that's the right thing. Oh, right, it's locked. Yeah, so like, where do we get the key? Did a little bit of searching around. Still can't find the key or anything. Um, but one thing I can do is start to assemble the gunpowder. I can't complete it, but I'm supposed to boil the sulfur, and I have the sulfur. So let's go for it. to be on it. Help retain the heat a little bit better. Okay. We got two of the three parts. Sulfur grains, milled charcoal, now we just need the saltpeter. I was hoping there'd magically be a key at the bottom of the pot revealed or something. Not that that would make any sense, but <laughs> it'd be nice. I'm also thinking about the elevator that I repaired. Well, I repaired the winch mechanism, but remember we need to put, like, boards or something down on the floor so we actually have something to step on, because most of the boards are broken. Which made me think of this, which seems to be for cutting wood, but I can't seem to use it in any way. I can't interact with it at all. I think it might be, like, lever-operated. And maybe you step on this or something, but... Like, the only thing we can do is just read the text on it. Don't use on metal. And oil blade after use, but there's no oil I can put on it. So it makes me feel like I probably am not meant to use that yet. I don't know, I'm confused. Okay, I just read a walkthrough. It seems like we have to go back inside of this building, and it's not that I missed something the first time I was in there, but rather that, uh, I guess before you find the note telling you where it is, the, the fact that the saltpeter... Was it saltpeter? Yeah, sulfur is what we have. Saltpeter is the one we need. Uh, before you find the note that tells you where the saltpeter is, you can't actually, like, like the stuff that you need to get in there won't trigger inside of this building, so we need to go in here again and something is going to happen. Kind of annoying. I hate it when there's, like, no reason to think of, like, why should I go back in there just because I think I missed something? I guess. It's eh. It's eh. <laughs> But anyway, uh, I think that's a pretty good place to end it because I think it's going to be a whole thing when I get in there. The walkthrough mentioned something about a first encounter with a monster. So, yeah. <laughs> See you in the next episode.